God's trial is final. Today I am hearing a voice over your life saying, Discharge and acquitted. Amen. Discharge and acquitted. Amen. Today, whatever heaven has against you, the mercy of God will prevail. Oh, whatever heaven, even enemies have against you, the mercy of God will prevail. You don't have anybody to run to, but God is on the throne. That is the reason for the vengeance of God. Now, vengeance is a tool. Tool that God uses in silencing evil men, in giving them their own justice, and their own justice is punishment. When the vengeance of God is activated, you will see the judicial aspect of God. God will judge the situation. If you are innocent, He will preserve you. If you are guilty, the sword of vengeance will do what? We condemn and at the same time execute you. The word of God said, Jeremiah 49, verse 11. The word of God says, Leave your fatherless children and that will preserve them alive. And the word of God says, Let the widows trust in me. Because you have nobody to speak for you. God is saying today, I will arise and fight for you. Amen. One thing is obvious about the judgment of God. That whether you are guilty or not guilty, God has discharged you and said what? You are free. Go and sin no more. Amen. I decree and declare. I receive. Your enemies will cry your cry. Amen. 